Last week, we switched gears once again and did some for us unconventional camping. We explored the Denver Botanical Gardens as well as spending time with family. This week, we find ourselves stranded and learning some hard lessons. We'll be facing some big decisions. After a night of mooch docking, we caravaned with family toward New Mexico for some more family time. to take a scenic route over La Vida Pass. Although this pass is 9,400 feet in elevation, it's relatively easy since the pass is free of sharp turns and steep grades. Last power for some reason. Five months earlier, we broke down within a few miles of this very spot. We were towed to the same diesel shop that we had fixed our truck previously. Unable to make a decision about roadside assistant membership, we paid out of pocket a whopping $600 each time this happened. Some people call this area our Bermuda Triangle. And yes, we have a membership now, although I still hear many mixed reviews on this. Fortunately, the shop let us park there and even gave us electric. So we waited for a diagnosis. We came to realize this wasn't going to be a quick fix, so we decided to make the best of it, and we did some exploring. waited for parts. Tensions were high. Some voices were raised and I think there was even a door slam in there. So what do you do when you have time to kill? Install all those RV modifications that have been just sitting around. Then we waited for a new diagnosis and more parts. Groceries were low and the walls were closing in on us. Fortunately, we had the Bronco bikes with us, so we went shopping and rode around Alamosa. we weren't getting out of here anytime soon. The hubs noticed that there were trails that we could ride their bikes on. These trails weren't on our trail app. They followed the Rio Grande. It was beautiful. It was a great find and it was just what we needed.
amazing how nature will calm your nerves and put everything into perspective. After a quick trip to the farmer's market, we were finally ready to leave. Only our engine light kept coming on. Thousands of dollars later, we wish we had done more research on this particular vehicle. We were going to have to cut our losses. We'll let you know what we did in the next video, where we take a thousand mile road trip through Utah. What did one wall say to the other? Let's meet at the corner.